Okay. Let's help out this Korok. Let's grab our... Uh, wait, where did we leave it? Over here. Let's grab our cart. And just... Go ahead and... Walk it over this way. Walk this way. Talk this way. Walk this way. Talk this way. I shouldn't have attached him. I should have just dropped him in. Because now when I shake him off, it's going to break the thing. Oh, well, whatever. Whee! Here you go, buddy. Yoink. Love that. All about that. Huge fan. Aight. Uh, so, what have we got over here? Chesticle. More Zonite. Sounds good to me. And what about up here? What's this thing? More minecart related hijinks? Ha. Huh. I am, however, noticing that <laughs> the floor is out on this. Can we fix that up? There's a hook. I don't. Th I think the hook is too small. It's quite a big gap, right? Hmm. Is that insurmountable? I think it might be. I don't think I could like... Well, let's find out. Get a log. Get another log. Can we... I don't think... I don't think we'll be able to fuse this to like an object in the world like that. Like, I don't think we can just plug the gap with this. But maybe? Won't know until I try. I can't even move it up high enough to find out. Yeah, I don't think that's happening. So I don't think there's any way of us getting across that then. Because if I put the minecart on the track, it's just going to fall off at that point. And there doesn't seem to be any way of plugging the gap. So I think we just have to give up and go the other way. Seems like it. Z 
zoomies. Bonk. Hip. Bidu bidu. Wait, isn't that where the third thing is? Huh. If the third thing is in unbearable cold. I guess I make some body temperature up things. <laughs> Discovered the pit cave. Excuse me, the mountain is extremely cold. You might die. Fortified how? Uh, please listen carefully. Meals that warm you. Warm sounding names. Thick clothes, warm by the fire. Be mindful of your ingredients. Don't change the effect. Yeah, you got it. You got it, my dude, you got it. Wait, is this a way out or is this just... Oh, hello. Rude. Little bitch. Bitch boy. Man, this is totally a way out or something, isn't it? Oh, hello. Thanks for shitting out another of these gems. Still don't know what they do. But I'll take them. Well, if we ever find a dark place, we're going to be absolutely fucking set at this point, huh? <laughs> God damn it. Anyone got a stick for me? Uh, I mean... What happens if you don't have a weapon? Because you need a weapon already to fuse that onto. But there's nothing in here that could make one. So you'd just be fucked, I guess? Obviously I have this, but... I guess you have to view... I, I'm not sure how you'd get out of here. I guess you just have to go back up. Fuck. I forget axes have already been fused. Can I just not get through here then? Hmm. I guess not, because there's no stick. I'd need a stick to be able to fuse to that, and I don't have one. So I guess I just have to leave the way I came, which is kind of weird. God, I forgot how slow climbing is in this game. I do think that's a bit weird, that they would put a rock wall and not put a stick down there to allow you to fuse it. Oh, is that a dead end? Oh, no. And this is the snow. Yeah, unbearable cold. Okay, well, we need to go and cook these then. Hmm. 
Yoink. And wasn't there something else outside I wanted to look at? Oh, the thing just leads back there. But yeah, we weren't able... We don't have a stick, so we weren't able to break through. Um, I guess I was just thinking about other ways I could get up there, but... I don't think it's happening, so... Whatever. It's fine. Let's cook ourselves... Nope, not that. Cook ourselves some spice. <laughs> Cold resistance for two and a half minutes. Okay. Uh, so does two of them equal five minutes? Get a couple of five minutes and a couple of two and a half. Seems smart. Don't want to waste them. go for five minutes. Nom. <sighs> Tremendous. Hello. Uh-oh. White choo-choo explodes in cold mist. Okay. Now we got to be fairly speedy here. We don't have tons of time to fuck around. What are you fuckers guarding? Is it always arrows in these things? Oh, great. Or sometimes nothing. Doo -doo -doo. It is... Wait, can we not... Oh god, is it going to be harder to get up there than I thought? <laughs> is there a cave? Oh, come on. Oh god, my health! Oh no! I did not realise... Did not realise we were so close to death. Let's chow down on one of these. So I guess the safe way to deal with those guys is arrows, huh? Wow, that looks cool. I look forward to exploring that place. Someday. That's a fucking captain, dude. Oh, but he's about to get bodied by ice bros. What the fuck was that? Oh yeah, fucking annihilate him, Ice Bros. No, Ice Bros. How could this happen to me? Fuck your fire. I have the power of water on my side. Uh. God, the frame rate is tanking here. Did I get him? Not yet. There we 
we go. <laughs> the frame rate was like, I'ma take a shit. A pepper that's been gently caressed by an open flame, it's much less spicy now. Do do do. If I take the long stick, does that burn me? No. Flame Emitter Club. That's cool. The Bottomless Cave. Bottomless, huh? Does not mix well with fire or electricity unless the goal is to blow things up. Ah, so I should have shot one of these at him with his... Uh, with his flamethrower and then... That would have been good times. Those creatures are very strange. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's not jump down there. Ooh, hello. Let's jump down here, though. Get another of you. Yoink. Just some amber. Alrighty. I mean, there is definitely a thing down there, but now is not the time. Dong. Dong. What in the fuck is that? I don't know, but I hate it. What do you do, motherfucker? Let me introduce you to the bomb flower. Oh no! Oh wait. Oh, it had a... Okay, I see. I mean, I don't have many of the bomb flowers, but... I feel like I'm wasting these, but I've got to know what comes out of this now, right? Oh my god, it drops a chest? Okay, well that wasn't what I was expecting to come out of it. Oh, just fucking opal. Like like stone. A strange round stone from a like like made of crystallized inner fluids. It's a good ingredient for elixirs. Hmm. Okay, sure. <laughs> I don't know what I expected, but that was absolutely not what I expected. I'll take it. A like like. I don't know, is the only way to get them to open up to bomb them? Or are there other ways that I just didn't see? I don't know. I don't know. Certainly take more of the bomb boys. Oh Christ, another one. Does it actually have any attacks? Is it just like a don't get too close to it situation? Ah, I see, okay. 
flame emitter. Hello. A Zonai device that shoots fire is thought to have originally used have been originally used as protection from monsters. Oh, like this. Flame emitter shield. Oh. Press and hold left. Interesting. I don't really have the health to fuck around with that right now. I think. I need to cook more food. Yeah, ah. Uh, I mean. Okay, this is kind of sick, actually. That is kind of cool. I really like that. This is awesome. <laughs> oh, does it always just contain an opal? Fuck, is it getting cold again? It is. Okay. Well, good thing we did, in fact, make more of these, huh? I wonder what you'd do at this point if you hadn't made more. I guess the flame emitters? I, 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 I guess walking along, firing out a flamethrower in front of you probably counts as keeping yourself warm, maybe? Interesting to think about. And we got some more spicy peppers if needed. Okay, we are almost at our third cheeky upgrade. Hello. There is a chest up there. There's also two dudes. And we're on a time limit, so I'm not sure. I'm kind of tempted, but I'm not sure it's a good idea on a time limit. And with not much in the way of healing options left. So I'm not going to. Oh. Shit. Okay. Spin to win. Oh, come on, just climb it. Nailed it. Easy game. Easy money. Do I really want to, like, bash these open? There's not usually anything actually that useful in there, is there? So, probably not. Probably not. Hello. I would like to go up there. Oh my god, I almost walked backwards off the cliff. That would have been embarrassing. 
And I'm like, I believe in you. You can walk in a straight line. You can do it, mate. Straight line? Yeah. That's within your capabilities, I think. Ah, it's another one of those. Ooh, hello. Archaic Warm Greaves. Hello. Despite the old look, the heat retaining material makes it pleasantly resistant to cold temperatures. Now that is a beauty. Hell yes. Huh, that doesn't actually have like a look to it. Okay, good. So we are now able, we don't, we no longer need to craft stuff to stay warm. So that is perfect. So now we technically could go and get whatever's in that chest, but then I'd have to work my way back up. But eh, we might do. But I do want to do this first. The Gutenbach Shrine. Let's see what our final thingy is. Final for now. Obviously, we've got loads more spaces on the old, uh, the old spinny wheel, but there's three of these, and this is the third one. So let's have ourselves a little look see. Come with me and you'll be in a world where we have a look-see. Sup, bitch? I hereby grant you some stuff. It's the ascend thing. Judging by that picture. Yeah. Move upward through solid material and emerge on top of it. This is the ascend ability. As you travel to what's directly above you. You'll find it quite useful in all sorts of places and situations. Use ascend and receive the blessing from the shrine. I love my shield. It's just a big fucking flame for her. The ability to rise. Rise with me, rise with me. Now, it has to be, like, fairly close to you. Like this, we can rise through. Obviously, the ceiling way up there, we cannot. Oh, I didn't know you... I thought it just popped you out. I didn't know you had the choice of when to get out. That's cool. Is there a... I know we have to go up through that one, but is there a chest on top of this one? Yes, there is. Hell yeah. Stone axe. Nice. And now, of course, there's nothing up there to rise through. Hello. Oh, he's paused. Time pauses when you're doing that. Right. Uh, okay. Is this just a beat the shit out of him moment? Haha. <laughs> oh no, my shit is burning. No, I shouldn't have set him on fire. Don't you hate it when wood burns? Crazy, right? Fucking insane. Okay, what have we got here? We got ourselves a drawbridge. So we just want to cut that. And then we can do the old bonk. Very cool, very fun. It just as it's passing under the middle here. Whoa. Yoink. Oh, we are going to find some applications for this. Blong. 
Well done, mate. Skip. Give me the orb. Bling. Get out of here, Chadley Chaddington. All right, so now we can go back to the Temple of Time. I see you've restored some power to that new arm of yours. Mm. The door to the Temple of Time should now open for you. Sick. Ah, so I didn't actually... Oh, I just realized my, my little <laughs> wooden log pile thing is gone. But that's the reason that this exists. <laughs> Makes sense. And then, once you're in here, you get that lovely suit, but also, you can do it again. Oh, it's a Korok thing! Hello! I know a fucking Korok thing when I see it. I know a fucking Korok thing when I see it. Easy money. You found me. You're not Hestu, but you see me? I didn't know someone like you could see Children of the Forest. If you see Hestu, please return this to him. Clappers. Keep an eye out while you wander. Indeed. Indeed. Oh, it's one of those fucking glide. Oh my god, it's a lot of those glider things. Hello. Oh, hell yeah. Are we about to actually use one? We're about to actually use one. Those things look sick. We could also push ourselves over there. Uh, is there a good and easy way down? I guess just like that. <laughs> Seems good enough to me. And yeah, just wearing these trousers means we don't have to heat ourselves up, so that's great. They're great. Hello, chum. Mm. The Zonai devices were the pinnacle of our technology. We built an advanced civilization with them and flourished for many, many years. If you can master the use of the Zonai devices, your quest will be much easier. I fucking bet, mate. Uh, okay, now there's no... It doesn't look like there's a super easy way to get up to this level, huh? Wait, unless... <laughs> Right, of course. It just makes sense, you know? You know? Let's put it a little closer. Uh... So, I can get out a fan. Oh, right, yeah, makes sense. And then I can get that. I can spin it that way. But also angle it, like, kind of up. No! I pressed... Oh, god damn it. This is, this is fucking Nintendo Switch controls being different to Xbox. I pressed what I know is the A button, but it's in fact the B button. And fucking yeeted my fan. Son of a bitch. Well, plenty more where that came from, I guess. God damn it. What a pain in the dick. Okay, take two. One, two, three, four. Rotate down slightly. And then attach. Oh my god, I just did it again. I'm actually going to shoot myself right in the head. This is terrible. This is my last attempt. <laughs> I've got, oh my god, I can't believe I just did that twice. Okay, I move it down, and then I attach. Let me fucking look at the button. A. There. Boom. Incredible stuff. Huh. 
And then... Right. Uh, I guess you can't stop it from... Because what we need now... Oh, it just recharges, huh? What we need now is to go up. I mean, I guess I could just hug the wall, right? But it's recharging. I assume we can't do it until it fully recharges? <laughs> Elevator going up. Yeah, that works. Thank you. Now, please make this worth my while. Oh, yes. I appreciate that. Nothing in those. Then I charge, alrighty. Okay. Okay, keep that over there. And then, <laughs> just one quick cannonball! Easy. Easy money. <laughs> oh, hello. Putting one in only got us one out, but putting five in got us like ten out? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, shit. We got a wing, we got a fan, we got a portable pot? What? A Zonai device for cooking food almost anytime, anywhere. Lasts for cooking one recipe only. Huh. Interesting. Now I know you can get rockets, but I'm wondering if it just doesn't let you get rockets at this point in the game. Like you're too early on to get rockets kind of thing. Certainly possible. Certainly possible. Alright, well, uh, let's take our bro over here. My behaviour is a threat. Oh, fucking threaten you, mate. Alright. So, I guess we want to get this off the track, huh? We'll just move it. Like, centred. So we're going back over there, yeah? It's a straight shot. Bang. There's also a lot of opportunity for it to go horribly wrong. Uh, but we are fucking Giga Chads and that won't happen. Simple. Alright, so. We just need to give it the old twisty twist. The old, uh, yoinky sploinky, as it were. The old bibbity bop. And then it's time for definitely nothing to go wrong. Here we go! That died like my hopes and dreams. Um, huh. So, what am I missing? Does it go... Is there like a channel on the bottom? Is it supposed to go in here? Uh, oh no. Oh no! Yeah, you can't... Oh, it's fine. We're gliding. I do need you to regen a little bit faster. We're, we're gonna be okay. Just like a little bit. There we go. There we go. Let's get some pace on us. Yeah. Hello, island. You look fun. I'd love to explore you one day. 
So having the fan go means that it doesn't drift anymore. Uh oh. Um, I think it would be good for my health if I did this. Never mind. That's bad for my health. That's death. I was I was aiming I was aiming for the water. You see, aiming for the water. Got the rock. An unfortunate situation. I would really like my parachute. When do I get my fucking parachute? <laughs> it's got to be soon, right? We've got the ha they have to give us the parachute to get down from here, surely. Where have I spawned? Oh, okay. That's unfortunate. Wait, did I even open the chest? Okay, it saved it saved me opening the chest, I guess. It didn't save that. didn't save this because that was our first portable pot for the second time. <laughs> so, yeah, okay. Um, Alright, so now, do I want to use a fan? I think, I actually think we're fine without the fan. I do believe. Stand centered. And let's take two. This is awesome, man. What a fucking cool game. What a fucking excellent game. The Giga Chad. And this time, I'm not going to bash my skull open on a rock. We're going to be very sensible and get off here. Incredibly sensible. The most sensible man anyone ever did see. And then we're going to fuck off over this way. Get our stamina back. Cheeky. Hello? I was trying to jump on the fucking lily pad, but sure. Oh no, please don't drown. Oof. Oof. That was a little bit, little bit worrying, not gonna lie. Just a smidge. Oh, Zelda, you're definitely just behind this door and the game's about to end, right? Right? Blop. Clap. Oh, hey, it's the first tier of the kingdom. <laughs> Hello? She levitates now. Cool party trick. Show off.
thanks, Mom. Appreciate it, whatever the fuck that is. I'm sure it's useful. <laughs> Recall. Reverse an object's movement until it goes back to where it was. You can stop the reverse movement at any time. Cool. That was the one we saw in the trailer of him, like, reversing a rock that fell from a sky island. The ability to reverse the movement of an object through time. And Zelda has vanished as well. What you just saw, it's a mystery even to me. Perhaps it was sort of an echo? One that reflects her sheer will. That you've now been given this ability, no doubt it will prove important. No doubt, my dude, no doubt. Oh, wait, shit. God damn it. I thought that. <laughs> I thought because I clicked stop, it would do that as well. Well, that one's on its own separate timer. Go. Oh. The goddess statue smiles upon you. Alright. What does that do for me, though? Unknown. stands as a test of your own vitality. Mm. You remain in a weakened state. You're not yet strong enough to open it. But there is one more shrine on this island. There you can get another blessing. Oh. If you add that to the other blessings you received at shrines and offer them all to the goddess, you might just find your way forward after all. Mm. Let me see the Pura Pad. Puripad lets you travel to certain places instantly. Now, see all of the blue marks on your map? They are teleport points. Nice, okay. Right, you can travel instantly to any of them. I suggest the one at the bottom of the map. Use the travel function to reach that area quickly. You'll find the last of this island's shrines around there somewhere. Like right there, for example. <laughs> Alrighty. Boink. Boink. And Link dissolved, never to be seen again. Honestly, fairly quick. Not too shabby, loading time-wise. Now I just have to run out of here again. Although... Yeah, I mean, it is just out here, right? <laughs> Unless... Haha! <laughs> <laughs> -ha. Interesting. Is this anything? Why is there just a big pillar thing? What is your purpose, pillar? I don't know. Well, thanks for nothing, friend. Huh. <laughs> 
Hello. <laughs> you found me. I sure did, buddy. Oh, chest. Nice. Yep. Three wings? You shouldn't have. Spoiling me rotten over here. Okay, so it says the last one is, like, right around here. But I'm not seeing it, which means it's underneath me, I guess. Indeed. Nice. Nachoya. This is a crystal refinery. I can take your charges and use them to produce energy wells. What's an energy well? Can increase the capacity of the cell you are carrying. Allows you to use devices for longer periods. I can produce these energy wells if you bring me crystallized charges. A hundred crystallized charges? What? Huh. Check the distant depth of the world below. That is its original source. Okay, so that's like a fucking come back here in a million years kind of goal. <laughs> that is not something that will be happening soon. What's down here? Is this a really long tunnel? Should I just go into the thing? Does this go anywhere? Oh, it goes. It goes. Okay, let's do this first then and then let's check out what's in here. I should also think about wrapping this up fairly soon, but I am very much into this, so let's finish this up, shall we? Yeah. It opens, we head in, we know the drill. I guess I shouldn't skip this next cutscene, because he gives us a new power and it tells us what it is, I suppose, so... I'm trying to think, is there any more powers? The ability to rewind. Oh, this is just a rewind shrine. Right. Okay. Can I rewind like... Oh, no, there's a... There we go. I was like, can I rewind the water itself and current... Have the current drag me the other way? But no. Whee! It's still, it's going slower this way because it's still being affected by the drag of the water. Which is interesting. Okay, now what? Very cool. Very, very cool. Interesting. So the door goes down when they both cross. Is it when they both cross at 12 or 6? Or only at 6? Interesting. It's 12 or 6. Okay. But I need to, like... I need to stop them rather than rewind them. Clappers. You did the thing. Here's your reward. 
Adios, amigos. Alright, sweet. So I can just travel back to the old Temple of Time. I think there is a fast travel there, right? I think so. However, before we do that, let's just head out here. And see what there is to see. In this little cave. Uh, oh wait, is this just where I woke up? This is just where I woke up, I think. Does this take me anywhere? God, okay. <laughs> I don't think there's anything up there, is there? Wait, I can't climb that? Hmm. Alright, sure. Um, So, now I just travel back to the Temple of Time, which I guess this is the closest one. Is there really not one, like, in here? I guess not. Hmm. Yeet. You would think that the main location would have a fast shower point. But apparently it does not. Alright, so it's just over there. How much of a pain in the dick is this going to be? Well... <laughs> Hello. Don't mind me. I'm just out here living my life, doing my thing. My condolences to your mother that you look that way. Fine, you know what? Bitch. And what? Fucking and what, mate? Hmm. Well, oh, you know what? <laughs> I was about to fucking go and chop down a tree and craft some fucking thing to get me up there, and then I'm like, wait, I can just walk over here and go up the actual stairs. <laughs> Created for this very purpose. Okay. Boink. Slowly, slowly walks my link. All right. You who have conquered the shrines and claimed their lights of blessing. In exchange for four lights of blessing, I will grant you power. You want a heart container? I sure do. It's time to journey our way back to having two full lines of hearts. Hell yeah. yeah. A rare item that restores some of the life force you lost to the gloom, increasing your maximum number of hearts by one. 
Go and bring peace to the world. Oh, I fucking will, mate. Open fucking sesame. Because I say so. Open says me. I'm just going to trust it. That I have enough life this time. Sweet. Beautiful. Ah, oh, good. I see you have managed to open the door. You haven't fully recovered yet, but that is to be expected. You're almost beyond saving. Funny how that keeps happening to me. By visiting the shrine. Last time I slept for a hundred years, though. This time it was only like what a couple you months. So I'm getting better at it. Effects. Though our time together has been brief, I am so happy that we finally met. Finally, huh? You are exactly as Zelda said. Done everything I can for her. Now it is up to you. Okay, bye. <laughs> Wouldn't it be nice if Link could just fucking talk? Wouldn't it be nice if he went, You've done everything you can for Zelda? What do you mean by that? Explain. What have you done for Zelda? Where is she? How have you helped? Oh man, that is some um, very purple sky, huh? That is not great. Uh, I mean, I see the gold over there. There's nothing I can rewind here. Uh, huh. Can I ultra hand these blocks? I feel like they're too big, but maybe? No, they are too big. So... How? I feel like I'm not supposed to get to the end yet, maybe? I mean, I guess I could make a glider, but I think that would just go straight down, right? Oh, I can ascend. Duh. It's almost like that's an important mechanic, which I should remember. <laughs> and will probably forget at some point, and there'll be something that I just have to ascend to, and I'll be like, I don't know how to get up there, herp de derp <laughs> Okay, golden light. What do you got? This has got to be the end of the uh, the tutorial, right? Is it going to set us loose on the world after this? The fuck? Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Man's like, hey, wait a minute, that's my fucking sword. Why, why, why did it disappear? <laughs> uh oh. To the kingdom of Hyrule. Oh boy. Uh, are we above water? <laughs> it's positioned us right here, so I'm going to just assume that we're above water. This is about to be very embarrassing if we're not. But let's hope. Okay, yeah, that does. Whee! I know I can accelerate, but it's just kind of cool, <laughs> you know? It's just kind of fucking sick. What is that over there? Who knows? Hmm, a lot of these patterns on the ground. Oh, there's a shrine. There's a shrine. What is that? Just a small floating rock. There's a shrine. There's a shrine. There's a shrine. So many shrines. Okay, that one is literally right there. Also, a fucking stable joint. Hopefully we can grab ourselves a horse fairly quickly. Yoink. Hyrule Kingdom. Here we are. Tutorial complete, I think it's safe to say. Good stuff. Well, with that, with our next target's insight, I think we're going to call it there for this session. This is really fucking good so far. I am actually having a blast. I really love the new mechanics. I think they're far more interesting than create round bomb or create square bomb. You know, like, <laughs> this is, this is, there's so much more you can do with the abilities in this game, it feels like. It's massively expanded on the previous game. And yeah, I'm hyped to continue and uh, re-explore this world and see what happens with the story. So yes, thank you very much for watching. Hope you're enjoying as well. If you are, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around, share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I will see you next time for more The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Thanks for watching. See you then.